To view and open SharePoint files with Windows File Explorer, go to the SharePoint Site Document Library you want to make available. Click the Sync button. You'll get a prompt to open OneDrive. If you don't have OneDrive, follow the prompt to install. A notification will show you you're syncing the folder. When syncing is finished, your SharePoint files appear on the left navigation of Windows File Explorer. Under your organization's name, your chosen document library is now available and synced. Click and open it like you normally would in Windows File Explorer. You can also add your synced SharePoint document library to quick access. Open Windows File Explorer and right-click on your newly synced document library. Click Pin to Quick Access. You will now see the shortcut under Quick Access. You can also create a desktop shortcut to access SharePoint. Right-click on the Synced Document Library. Click Show More Options. Choose Send To, and then Desktop. Create Shortcut. Your document library is now available from your desktop. Keep in mind that deleting the shortcut does not delete the Synced Document Library. You can also work with SharePoint files without downloading all the documents and using up your device's storage. Click the blue OneDrive icon in your Windows notification area. Click Settings, and then the Settings tab. Tick the box under Files on Demand. This will save space and download files as you use them. You can also choose specific files or folders and select either to always keep the files on your device, or you can free up the space and have it available on demand from the cloud. If you ever want to stop syncing your SharePoint files, click on the OneDrive icon on the bottom right of your screen, click Settings, and under the Account tab, click Stop Sync by the document library you want to remove from syncing. You can also choose specific folders to be available in your OneDrive folder. Remember, history versions are not copied when using Sync on Windows File Explorer. Only the latest or published versions are copied. Also, file conflicts can occur between local and SharePoint versions. Click on the OneDrive icon on the taskbar and choose Resolve to view options for resolving conflicts. For more Microsoft 365 tips and tricks, subscribe to our channel and check out our Syskit blog.